I'm Dr. Donald Gossett. I'm an oral and maxillofacial surgeon. Uh, I have <clears throat> training in dentistry and specialty training in maxillofacial surgery. Uh, today we're going to speak about some fairly general aspects of uh, general dentistry and possibly uh, specialized dentistry and hopefully be able to educate you a little better on some of those topics. We're going to talk about natural home mechanisms to be able to care for toothaches. Uh, for many, many years, it wasn't, uh, it wasn't available to us to go down to the local Rexall and grab medicinals. Uh, a lot of people had to use home remedies, and those are things that you have in your home that you either cook with or various and sundry others uh, that are at your disposal. One of the most common uh, mechanisms to solve a toothache was oil of clove. And it's actually something we still use sometimes in, say, dry sockets and various and, uh, and sundry other painful syndromes that we have uh, where the bones achy or, or painful. Uh, it's very good because it helps for uh, the killing of bacteria and it also improves pain quite drastically. Uh, another is to use garlic clove and to put it down into the area where the tooth is aching. Uh, this oftentimes helps. Uh, and there are several other uh, uh, home remedies that uh, people have used. Historically, they used to use, even use uh, bird poop and stick it in the, uh, the area where the cavity was. And a lot of it's just mechanical trying to cover up where the nerve is. But these were old mechanisms to try to improve pain and, and um, help uh, take away toothaches and pain. This is uh, Dr. Donald Gossett. I hope you enjoyed uh, the information to the point to where um, you may pursue dentistry or you may pursue uh, the benefits of some of the treatment alternatives.